You're not eating me. How can I, after the things you said? You wanted me to be honest. I know, I just, uh, I didn't expect it to hurt this much. I just don't know what you want from me. I want you to tell me why. Why are you still with me when you don't love me? Not like I don't, I, I want to be with you, I just, I can't. Why? I don't know, I'm just not ready to be in a relationship, I guess. But you were the one to ask me, you were the one that wanted to be exclusive. I know, but like, you're just different than who I thought you were. How? How am I different? Great. I just lost my appetite. 
Can we not talk about this? Please. Please. Just tell me. Just tell me the truth. That's all I'm asking from you. All right. I guess I was more interested in who you seem to be than who you actually are. You know, when I met you, I thought you were cool and kind of intimidating. You also seem focused on your projects, which are traits I like. Okay. You also looked like a girl that would break my heart. And I have a soft spot for that. And how am I different? I don't know, you put too much effort into a relationship, you love too much, you're clingy. So wanting to see each other once a week is clingy? I guess I just wanted to feel like you also want me. Yeah, I just don't feel this need to text, to call daily, you know, I just wanted to focus on my work and when I would find time I would see you, but this the assurance thing you ask of me sometimes is it's just too much for me. But I told you my attachment style when I met you. I told you I needed reassurance. Oh my god, do, do you really think I'm wasting my time reading about fucking attachment types on the internet? I don't do that. I'm not like you watching fucking relationship videos. I have to work. I'm trying to make something out of my life and you should do the same. Wait, wait, wait. But I am, I am trying. I'm trying to follow my passion. Babe, if you want to be a successful artist, work hard for that day and night without sleep. Do you really think you can do that by having your hobbies, playing video games, planning dates every weekend? Just because you paint on a canvas every now and then doesn't mean you can make a living out of it. But I am trying. I'm trying to follow my passion. It's just difficult for me right now. And I wanted to put an effort into being with you. Why is it wrong to do both? You told me you hated how your ex treated you. You told me you didn't put enough effort, that he didn't take care of you properly. And I wanted to be the one to show you that I can love you. Can you know, it's just different with him. He just had something special. And how is that supposed to make me feel? You told me he treated you like shit and that you never want to see him again. And then I found out that you're texting him behind my back. But I already told you that texting didn't mean anything. He just, he wanted to check up on me and he's an asshole, but I think I think I'll always have a part of him in my heart. Fuck you. What did you say? Fuck you, that's what I said. I went against all of my friends who said you were not a good person. I defended you and I put an effort because I wanted to be a decent fucking human being to you. And all that I get from you is that I'm clingy. But this bullshit about your ex and your heart, look around you. It's like I don't even belong here. And I wish someone would love me the way that I love you. Or I wish you would at least break up with me instead of holding me back, telling me the way that I love is wrong. I am not the one who loves too much. You're just the one who loves too little.
Good afternoon. We are pleased to inform you that we accept your submission to have your painting displayed in our new exhibition. Looking forward to working with you. Can regards at the